Good day everyone. Let's look at this question. Please don't skip any part of this video. Watch it from the beginning to the end. It's very important. Starting from rest, a car of mass 900 kg as an rate steadily to 50 meters per second in 10 seconds. The average power developed in the same time period is dash. That is the question. Now, in physics, if a body is starting from red, we will call it initial velocity zero. That is the meaning of the body starting from red. That means the initial velocity is zero. Then, in that as an instant, another velocity which is we call the or term the final velocity which is equals to 15 meters per second. So this rest tells us that the initial velocity is zero. That is the meaning of that. Then look at this will become the final velocity now. And the mass is 900 kg. The time for this uh, uh, steady acceleration is 10 seconds. Now, remember that power is equal to force times velocity. Power is the product of force times what? Force and velocity. That is power. So if we apply this formula now, this we are going to have. Let's see what, what we are going to have. Let's see what we are going to have. Then force is equal to mass acceleration from Newton's second law of motion. So acceleration is change in velocity related to time. Which is final velocity minus initial velocity divided by time. So if you substitute the values here, m which is 900, this which is 15 minus 0 divided by 10, so you're going to have 1,350 1, newtons for your force. So the force times the velocity now will be power, which is 20,250 watts. Or if you rise by 1,000, if you divide it by 1,000, you're going to have 20.25, then the answer will now be in kilowatt. This is what we're going to have as our answer. Thank you. God bless you.